what's up guys, Chelsea Briggs here, coming to you from South by Southwest 2012. Currently hanging out with Jamie Scott of Graffiti 6. Hello. How goes it? It goes well. How is your South by experience so far? Are you surviving? It's been amazing, yeah. yeah. And is this your first South by? Uh, I've been here once before actually, I played five years ago. Wow, so five years ago to this South by, what's sort of the different mindset you have going on? I'm playing in front of a lot more people this time. <laughs> <laughs> it's your first album, so what is it about the album you're most proud of, would you say? Just the fact that we made a record we wanted to make, and that's kind of, uh, I know it sounds like an easy thing to say, but I've been signed to two re labels before, and um, the way we did this record was to sign it to ourselves, and then when the, re when the record was finished, sign it to a label, and it really does make a difference. Uh, I just, there's not one thing on the record I would change, and you know, every other record I've made, there's always a few things where... I, give and take and there was none on this record it was uh, it was really just how I wanted it so well, one of your songs I want to talk about goodbye Jeffrey Drake sort of a, a dark song my name is Jeffrey Drake and you under arrest he said let me down the road and change neighbors all turn this can you tell me uh, it's about a guy who kill, finds his ex-girlfriend and kills her so ooh, how do I know that I've got my resources because not many people do it is about that but not many people do know everyone comes up to me after shows and goes I love that goodbye Jeffrey Drake and you know it's and then what it's because in the chorus is all I wanted was a little love everyone hears the chorus and it's like yeah I want a little love and I'm like I love that song I'm like do you know what this song is about what's the reaction when you tell them no, I, I mean, well, I sometimes they're also happy, and I, I kind of like, yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't want to burst your bubble, yeah, exactly. but. <laughs> but uh, I mean, you know, it's still that's that that was the creepy thing about the song. We, I sat down, to try and write lyrically something that was, you know, um, there is a romanticism in it, and the whole point was I wasn't trying to um, romanticize <laughs> people killing people. I was trying to romanticize the fact, uh, the depth of love. I ask you, so when I first brought that up, did you think I was going to be one of those that was like, it's so great and it's cheering? So great. I was like, oh, here we go again. <laughs> and you're like, oh, no. <laughs> yeah. you. um, so has love ever made you do something crazy? I broke down a door once. Violence. <laughs> I, no, no, I, I didn't, I've never hurt anyone. I broke down a door, though. The door, I was, the I was door, hoping I wasn't, I wasn't fishing for that. Yeah, <laughs> the door was made of wood, and it was fine. It, it got replaced. Okay. Um, we'll that was... Uh, that wasn't that wasn't in anger towards someone. That was because I found out something. I was never going to actually, you know, hurt that person. I just got very angry, and I might have broken down a door to try and find something out. <laughs> oh no! I hate that. Horrible. Horrible. Did you learn your lesson? Yeah, doors are strong. <laughs> <laughs> how do you how do you write the music? How do you write the lyrics? Uh, lyrics, I always write. Uh, last, I've never. I write a lot for other bands as well. Um, I've been doing a lot of the work, writing for this new band that's come out here, One Direction. I love One Direction. I was actually going to ask you about that. Yeah, and uh, and but it, even even when it's not my own stuff, I never write lyrics first. I always write melodies and music, and it's kind of the thing that when I have a song and a melody sounding right, I then sit down and do the lyrics. And me, myself, and Tommy pretty much did that for the um, for the Graffiti Six album as well. Well, thank you so much. Congratulations with everything. And for more on South by Southwest 2012, be sure to head to hollywire.com and hollywire.tv.